Hey guys, this is Michael, and, um, I'm back. So, um, Dragon Ball Raging Blast 2 is a game that just came out, I think, November 2nd, and then Japan came out November 12th or 7th, and I just wanted to say before I start this review that this game got out in U.S. or North America, I think, before Japan, even though the game was made in Japan. This is like, I don't know if this is the first time, but this is one of the first games that I've bought that that this has happened. Like most Pokemon games and all those other Dragon Ball Z games or anything that's made in Japan usually comes there out first, but no. They actually delayed it by a week or so. Okay, this game actually got a 5.5 on IGN and most people are saying that it's not the best, but I disagree. I really, 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 really like it. Really. I watched the movie, the um, Jaimal's Plan to Eradicate the Saiyans. It was actually pretty good. Vegeta even said, you know, crap and stuff, but I mean, it says rated teen, so I don't see any way that people should get mad at, like, you know, them saying this. You know, like, they do it in the Japanese version, so, I mean, they, they should be able to do it in the English version. Since Kai doesn't let any, anything to do with violence, like, bloody violence, or anything to do with bad language. So, um, this game I would give for, uh, plot, galaxy worlds and stuff, like, it's, each character has an his own galaxy and you get picture like a little image after you defeat each level in the galaxy and that is amazing that is like there are about I don't know I did Goku Goku's uh, galaxy there's at least like tw 10 or 12 levels or so and um, you get a picture for each but imagine that for every single character and there's like 60 or 70 characters at least um, I think if you buy it the first week or something, if you bought it the first week in Toys R Us or GameStop, it comes with an enhanced Broly and a Trunks with the sword. Two enhanced characters. Just, I don't know. I want to get Gogeta in this game. Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, because he's my favorite character throughout all time. But I would give this game a lot higher than a 5.5. I would give this game at least a 9 or an 8. It's really good. It's so fun. You can play with your friends at your house. You can play your, with your friends through live. Um, well, I'm talking about Xbox 360 at least. I mean, I don't really like PlayStation 3 that much, but I like it, just not as much as Xbox or the Wii. I just, it's down there somewhere after those two. Um, so if you're planning on getting this game, I totally suggest it, because I would give it an 8 or a 9. The galaxies are pretty good, not not too good, but there's no, there's really no story at all. Only the movie has a story. There is no story in the galaxies. Like, when you're in Goku's galaxy, I think the second or third level is just cooler. And then you fight Vegeta as, like, the boss or something. 